this is something very new i'm starting it with you for the first time this is what we are going to call technical talk and in mm. this the brains that we have in this podcast like you yourself you are masters from iic bangalore one of the best students you must have been at that time and you have yes. such huge experience in technical field so right. with you we would like to start with ic design and vlsi what can you explain about that it will give uh, a very good idea to yes. the students who are preparing see, what uh, they might what, say what uh, what i can give the suggestion to the students those who are doing engineering right now see when you are preparing for gate okay see when we are only preparing for college na that is just a very casual studies we know but when we are preparing for gate so actually we are learning the concepts you can pick up the subjects like digital or analog which are related to the ic design being in india let me tell you the most of the work is in digital side okay i mean digital vlsi more work is in there matlab whatever countries you whatever whatever companies you talk about whether it is you know nvidia or intel or texas or analog devices i have you know many of my friends working in this company but majority of the work in our country is in digital vlsi rather than analog vlsi so anyone having the you know interest in digital side you know you can first of course learn the concepts through gate examination the first is concept like getting hold you know what counters are what flip flops are how you can design a sequential circuit but if you get a real interest okay maybe first step is qualify the gate examination mm. okay because you know even if you do a little bit smaller project on your own and but if you don't reach a good level if you don't reach a psc or if you don't reach a good uh, masters place then maybe that knowledge of you might not be that useful unless and until you are from you are from a very strong btech college like iit or something yes, yes. okay for which for them gate is not a very big uh, requirement i know yes. but for a normal engineering college student first target gate learn your concepts and maybe just as you qualify the gate and if you have interest in these subjects like digital or analog now i'll suggest you there are so many softwares available okay you can contact us i can you know you know the students which are in contact with ashish i can you know if they need we can directly provide some softwares to them as well yeah, i'll put all the contact information in the description box. yes yeah. hmm. so if you really want to be good in electronics right now so suppose if you are going to a interview and you don't know anything about chip designing okay you only know theory ki how and gate works or you know what is the definition of and gate f equal to a into b no one is going to give you any any job on based on that okay but do you know actually insides of gate how they are built how they are fabricated okay and how if i give you a circuit can you uh, simulate that circuit at least on a fpga board can you give me the real time results ki if this is a counter how it is working can you connect it with a seven segment display and prove me the counter is you know tickling up with 0 1 2 3 okay can you design a seven segment display you know seven segment display which are used in the traffic lights or all the digital meters you know bikes may be jo display hota hai that is what is known as the seven segment display and it's very easy to design i'm talking about the very basic thing mai bahut zyada to btech ke liye bolunga bhi nahi so you yeah. know whatever is possible you know these days btech students at least can target designing a 8 bit processor hmm. i'm not talking about a 64 bit design but at least you can try a 8 bit basic alu okay basic alu means which is able to perform some arithmetic and logical operations basic arithmetic operation okay addition subtraction and then anding oring xoring at least 8 bit processor alu you can try to target in your projects <laughs> whatever projects you are doing do it by your own because you know lots of btech students there is a group of 5 to 6 in the btech project one or two are very serious three to four just wo dosti yaari mein unka project ban jata hai mm-hmm. more than that there is a trend students are going to purchase market uh, projects hmm. matlab they are not at all interested in building the projects and they are <laughs> just it. going to the market and buy it from the market but let me tell you wo aapko you know temporary happiness de dega but after the gate you know interview phase will come hmm. Okay, and I get is, that question very often. Right. What do I do? I bought my project. <laughs> yes, but what? But but what will happen? In especially in IIC and IIT interview, they will, you know, in interview what they will ask, they will some ask basic questions regarding to your gate syllabus only. But you know, there are two things they will mostly focus. One is your project. As I told you, IIC every course itself is having a mini project, so they want to test how much good you are in project. Mm-hmm. Okay. आप सारे क्वेश्चन आंसर कर दो बट यू आर नॉट एबल टू जस्टिफाई योर प्रोजेक्ट दे आस्क यू वॉट वॉज योर बी टेक फाइनल ईयर प्रोजेक्ट यू टेल सर दिस इज वॉट इज द नेम वॉट यू डिड यू आर ब्लैंक बिकॉज यू परचेज फ्रॉम द मार्केट थोड़ा बहुत बता पाओगे जितना आपने रट लिया होगा बट नॉट मोर देन दैट यू विल एक्सप्लेन इट टू योर कॉलेज प्रोफेसर प्रेजेंटेशन बट नॉट टू दी आई एस सी एंड आई टी प्रोफेस एंड इफ यू फेल इन दैट एरिया most likely you are not going to get selected mm-hmm. okay in in iic there is a department see there in vlsi related there are two departments one is microelectronics mm. okay and uh, one of them is uh, des a department of electronics and systems engineering okay earlier it was known as cedt in my time uh, that is a department you know 
because of which placements are pretty good in ISC. Okay, because most of the professors in that department have been, you know, associated with companies like they have worked in the companies like Texas or Intel and they are also currently the consultants of those company. That is one department where, you know, you will not find maybe a professor coming from MIT or Stanford. Okay, he might not be from a very good university like Stanford, but he has, you know, around seven to eight years of experience with Texas. And he's there in the institute to give all his practical knowledge, his experience and he, uh, is there to teach the students in that particular manner. Right. So when you are aiming to reach such an organization, such a level, okay, where you are going to work with such kind of professors, try to make better yourselves from the graduation only. Mm -hmm. The pehli priority gate ka rukho, get your concepts because without concepts, practical bhi zero hai. If you don't know the concepts, you mm -hmm. bana doge. Mm -hmm. Okay. So... But, but after concepts, I think learn the practical applications as well. Right, small right. small projects. Design a traffic light system. You know, practical. You will see. You are daily walking on the street. You are seeing some traffic light. Can't you design it? You can design it at the BTEC level. Nothing new. Okay, mm -hmm. start with the basic seven segment display. Okay, aim up to the final year complete. Aim, aim at least for processor. Designing a processor or at least some part of a processor ALU integrated with memory. Some part you can design. Mm -hmm. You'll really feel good and you'll have good job opportunities as well. All right. Okay, sir. That was very, very interesting. Now, let us get into one part. That is the final goal. It might also motivate a lot of people and also might rule out a lot of people who actually thought that the goal would be something else. So, how is the life of two years in 